Jesus and I can't fuck with snakes. I ain't all the way back from my people. I pray out for for fame. I'm finna turn up and get a ass a taste. I thought I was global. They screaming my name. I'm everywhere like I'm the Chicago way. Way. Alright, well, how you coming? Yo, you already know, man. I'm back. I'm already know I'm back with another one, man. My nigga Wade, you already know I'm coming, man. Man, this ain't going to be a little bit heavy. You know, you know, because, uh, <laughs> M.I.J. Main voice, you know, it was a lot of over whooping last time, you know, so we had to, uh, you know. Yeah, that fix that little whoop. It's all good, though. Sure. So, nothing like a little, nothing like a little. No, I just, you know, you did, you did. Like I said, I appreciate my boy Wade, you know, for, you know, for fucking with, you know, real niggas, you know, so he a real nigga, so don't play, sure. with, don't play with him. Like, bro. like, 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 uh, like my friend Mel Buck said, I'm Hollywood, not Hollywood, you did. No, you know, shout out Pretty Out, um, bro. Shout out Pretty Out, D. I already know what's going on. All right, now, uh, back to finish the question that was supposed to be finished last week. Exactly, let's do our homework. I right, so now uh, you know everybody loves getting fried and shit. Mm -hmm. But you know that's why I like to call this segment the it hit different segment. Shout out J Man, you did. <laughs> now um uh, the thing is we ain't gonna talk about what he said he different. You know, you wanna know what I say he different? <laughs> What's that? Like? My first time getting fried, my guy. First time smoking weed. Man, and I read, and you and we and you see how much we don't smoke. You know, but we gonna take it back real quick. Remember the first, the funniest time that that ha funny shit that happened to you when you was smoking weed, or maybe your first time smoking? Man, bro, my first time smoking, I so like I said, right? I used to, I was a rookie, so now since at a ten, when I was smoking, I was like uh, linking up, linking up before school, linking up before school, you know, getting up with the guys, you know, we put on, you know, at this time. At this time, we putting on for next, you know what I mean? So, I already know how that go. But, when it came down to, like, my first, you said my first time getting caught smoking? Man, it's just some funny shit. Oh, yeah, some funny but shit. But see, right. if you guys, if you guys no, know, it's no, just funny. It feels pretty good that, right? Man. My first time getting yeah. caught smoking was like, all right, so I got asthma type shit. Or at least I had asthma. I'm smoking. Man. I, 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 I went out. I'ma say had because I smoke too much for yeah, I ain't gonna see you no pump at all. I smoke too much now, so if that shit went away, you know what I mean, thank God. But yeah though, like I said, it was still a rookie, you know what I mean? And still had asthma, so I guess I got one had two night. I got one had two night with the gang type shit, we out the woo. So I go upstairs, like like my people, my people stayed downstairs from my OG at the time. So um bro, um I I fell short of breath type shit, you know? You know, I fell short of breath. So um bro, I end up I end up going upstairs, cutting on my cutting on my um cutting on my what's it called? Uh air machine, you know, you know I know what it's called, air machine, whatever they get asthmatic people type shit, breathing machine, that's what it's called. Um bro, I cut on my breathing machine, put my little mask on. Now I'm so high. And the little shit that they they tell you put in a machine, you know what I mean? Yeah. The shit got me so woozy, I fall asleep. <laughs> I fall asleep with the I fall asleep with the um with the mask on for about like hours, my OG. Oh, mask? Yes, you know, you know the little mask that the ambulance put on you. Oh like, that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, damn. Yeah, I, I had one of them, so it's like I fall asleep, she wake up. See me with the mask on, the breathing machine still on. She look at my face. She say, "Man, your ass, your ass high. <laughs> That's why you wake up. Off your sweat. That's why you woo." I got cursed out, but I was so high, I was just like this. <laughs> I ain't get no fuck what she oh, was saying. <laughs> you know, it, yeah, it real different. I was it, it, it hit different when you, when you, when you get hot, get so high. You supposedly had ass, but then you wake up and everything starts to weird that down. But that breathing chill, you know. I, I honestly felt like I was destined to smoke. I was, my, my OG was smoking beer. You know, my OG smoking beer in the wall. Yeah, I remember, I remember my first time getting fried. And it's like, for me, like, I was telling Shadow, I was like, man, I'm fucking with Shadow. Like, first of all, I was in Minnesota. I wasn't even in Chicago when this shit happened. I was in Minnesota getting fried my homie and shit. We smoking. And the thing is, I'm not even getting high for real. Like, I'm just. Bro, you gotta inhale that shit. It took me four days to get this shit straight. So to try to play this shit off, I used to, we get drunk and hot. We, yeah, we used to do it all. But I get drunk, I 
acting and crossfading here just to act like I felt something. They like, bro, shut your bitch ass up. You not even high. In front, front of your move and shit. They all, they all my ass. When I finally got pat down to it, all I, like, I, nothing much happened to me. I just got hungry and I was just, just looking up, like, on paranoid and shit. And I'm like, yeah, hey, what's that? And I'm getting cold and hot and shit. It's like, bike temperature rising. And, 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 and I'm all in. I'm always tell the kids, man, don't don't do drugs, man, because because one thing one thing that I that I always thought wasn't true that is true when it comes down to specifically weed, weed is a gateway to other drugs. You want to know why? Because you know why. I mean, anyway, weed is the gateway to other drugs because um, if you take something else other than weed or you smoke something else other than if you smoke some, you know what I mean, like if you take something else, the weed gonna activate it. Without the weed, any other drug you take is not gonna activate it until you hit that blunt. And that go for liquor, that go for any type of pharmaceuticals. You know, like, y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You know what's you know, <laughs> you know, you know, crazy? You know, I did an interview with Disco from Adia. Like, the formerly known as Deuce Gang Disco, and his message to the youth was just stay in, smoke weed and stay in school. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Because we ain't never killed nobody. <laughs> Segment and this is one of my. This is a funny segment down here. Get back and ask the people because I don't be having the time. Shit, like you know, I, we, we talk, when I talk, it don't be interviews. This just be a conversation. That's all this shit is. Like, like, like this shit is more than just question and answer. This is like us just having a genuine conversation and shit. Exactly. Yeah. But one thing I always ask them, of, like I used to always like ask them, of, so I'm thinking back and ask them is like about this segment. I like to call it the G's and the Dose session. So my question to you is: Are the G's and the Dose? Yes or no? Man. We so in the dough. We so in the dough. We can't get kicked out that motherfucker. But you know, we ain't in the dough. We ain't in the dough as much as they want us to be in the dough. You know what I mean? Oh. You know, and shout out Shirak Bands. You know what I mean? Shout out, um. Somebody shout, out, shout out Shirak Bands. Shout out Fonzo. You know what I mean? Somebody be trying to get there. You know, my boy. Like, oh, Fonzo just came back too. Oh, my boy just came home. Yeah, welcome skit. back, Fonzo. You know, and. and and uh, you know, shout out, you know, shout out, all, shout out all the guys. You know what I mean? Hey, you already know I'll be coming, man. Like we gonna get it done, young. You know, we gonna get it, we gonna get it done, young. You know, shout out. Yeah, for sure. But uh, but the thing is, you know, GDs is in the dough for what you basically just said here. But we still got some people that wanna get in the dough with the GDs because like the GDs can get in the dough so can we. But the thing is, we don't know how. So we happen to know how the GDs got in the dough. Aruba, you know what I mean? Damn, so he don't, he don't even know who, who know how the G no, got in? No, no, but he, he put, he put, he put his ten toes in his shit, and he, 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 he gave us the recognition that we needed for a motherfucker to even be able to say that we are in the dome. You know what I mean? And is he the only one motherfucker? Because no, more, there's more GDs. No, it's more GDs. You know All what I right. mean? Shout, shout out Duck, shout out FBG Duck. You already know that, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out Chicago Legends. You know what I mean? Chicago legend, but when we speaking on specifically GDs, yeah, it is motherfucking Ruga. It is motherfucking FBG Duck. And they ain't gonna hold you. It's Lil J. Uh, mm -hmm. It's motherfucking um, and I'm just trying to speak on specifically rappers mm -hmm. that that claim that they wanted a that they wanted a gas. Uh, the ones that proudly claim it, cause yeah. we got some people that said, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like we was talking, we was talking about FBG Duck's blood brother. He did say that GD's getting the dope. No. And, 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 and the thing is, he's a BD. He's not. No, 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 no. no. He said he used to be BD. He, he doesn't game bang no more, nothing like that. But oh. he, did, he did say that GD's is in the dope. But nowadays, the G's are more comfortable saying they GD. Because at first, it wasn't a lot of G's that's proud to be like, I'm a GD, you yeah, know? Sure you know? That. But sure he said nowadays, everyone's comfortable saying GD. That's why they're able to say they get in the dope still. Show that. Even though, you know what I mean? I don't even really be thinking. A lot of motherfuckers be, uh, be like proud to acknowledge it, but they, but they, you know, they, they ain't. It's like, like you said, it is, it is more common that a motherfucker tell you what it is, what it is, but you know what I mean, when it is, you know. So yeah, you know, shout out, shout out, folks, them. Shout, yeah, sure. shout out, folks, them. And uh, just last question about this topic. Uh, 
Is there any way that the genies can stay in the door? In my opinion, I just say keep doing. I just say keep doing. What Chicago doing right now? Making this shit fun again. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't even gonna hold you that this shit. Chicago always been fun. It has, but, mm -hmm. you know, mixed with the violence. Mixed with the violence, it's hard for motherfuckers to do what Chicago used to do, you know? Like, it'd be a, it was a point in time in which it was like, everybody was outside, you know? No matter what side you was from, how you was from it. And Chicago known for teeing shit up. Whether, whether it be a Fifi, whether it be a trend, whether it be a link up, whether it be a party, whether it be a kickback, whatever you want to call it. Chicago known for turning shit up, you know what I mean? And when it come down to keeping the GDs in the door, you know what I mean? Just, 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 just keep doing how you doing it. Just keep, you know what I mean? Like, 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 you know, just keep, keep, keep this shit strictly on music. Keep your shit strictly on business. And then can't nobody, can't nobody... <laughs> Can't nobody say that they got a black body. Can't nobody listen to another motherfucker and say, oh, don't, don't work with him because he this and he that. Because at the end of the day, you still you and you, you know what I mean? You still you. You just a different, you know? You just a different, you know? But like I said, one thing I can say about um, other gangs, uh, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna put no name on it, but y'all know the Chicago artist that's artisan right now, you know what I mean? That ain't. GD, but at the end of the day, they doing something other than this. You know what I mean? They 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 bring a different aura to this this music shit, and, and and that's really what I feel as if the GDs need to do to stay in the dough. You know what I mean? To to become more on the relevant side. Cause once you win that bitch, once your ten feet in that bitch, your ten feet in that bitch. You know what I mean? That's just like dirt. Dirt where you from? Where you from? You know? But it's ten feet in that bitch. So now it's, you know, so now can't nobody say nothing. Can't nobody do nothing. He still where you from. He still say that shit in the music. He still do what he do. But he done made it. So mm. let's 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 follow in the footsteps and then do what we do once we get our back. No back. And I'm glad you said that. Cause we do got some people that's not in those same shoes, you did. Show that. Show that. But uh yeah, you know, there's a there's a topic, and this is a topic we ask everybody. The GDs, the BDs, the Stones, the Souls, the Lords, the Neutrons. When I say Neutrons, I mean niggas with neutral, not shit to nothing. Sure. And this is a segment that I love to talk about. And I like to call it the blackball theory. Mm. Now, do you believe blackballing is real, yes or no? Yes. Alright, do you want to explain why, or do you want me to get on to the, to the question? Or you... When I talk about it before I get before I explain. I ain't gonna keep my spiel long, but I feel like black balling is real because I honestly do feel like it be other artists that got connections to certain people and certain shit that, you know what I mean, we'll put the word in a certain motherfucker ear and say, Oh, they ain't good for the something or they ain't good for the brand or ain't good for the label, or ain't good for for whatever, for whatever the case may be and that's considered black ball, you know, because you know you got that power, and you know, when it come down to the Chicago shit, it really get like that, it really get like that, for real, like, you know, it really get like that, so, yeah, motherfuckers do, motherfuckers do do that. Hmm, alright, well, since that's the case, who is being blackballed out here? Man, who being blackballed out here? I mean, I mean... I can't I, I I can't really I can't really speak on a specific artist that's being blackballed per se, but I will say some people who I feel as if should have been had they recognition and based off and based off, you know what I mean, them being a product to the environment, like we all are, us being from Chicago, they do not get recognized unlike other artists. And I'm gonna name I'm gonna name a couple. I'm gonna name a couple. Um, I'm gonna say 10K Kobe. I feel like he should be father the way he is now. Um, and he also spoke with us about the black bar thing. On game. Um, I feel my my nigga. Uh, what's his name? B B B B B B B B E Bands. Wait, B B E Bands? Yeah, I, that's his name. B B Bands. 
DBE bands. DB, I know a GD bands, but I don't nah, know DBE bands. Nah, my, my, my boy, he got the, the he got the big, like he be he be rapping with the with the girl. Uh, I think her name is Mia K type shit, but he got the he got the real big ass. Oh, 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 that's, oh, that's something like different. I, I think I, I think I seen him before because I posted the MK a couple yeah, times. Yeah, I got, I got to make sure I do the research. Yeah, um, bro, you had just recently posted them type shit, type shit, you know. Um, but right. shout out my boy. I don't know how, I don't know how far he is, but I do feel like he got potential to be father than it, you know. But um, him, um, motherfucking uh, um. Uh, I, I would say pretty much. I would say pretty much the girls, the girls, they 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 doing their shit. I feel, I feel like the girls they getting their recognition. You know what I mean? Whether the process be slow or not, slow motion is better than no motion. Um, I feel like my boy Young, my boy Young, he got it. It's, it's a lot of people named Young. FBG Young, you know. Oh, young. I mean? FBG Young, FBG Dutchy, you know what I mean? Young, you know what I mean? Uh, Feel like they got it. I feel like they got it. Oh, man, who else? Type shit. Uh, it's, it's so motherfucking. It's, it's a it's a you know, list. It's so and recently we oh yeah, Shirek bands, Shirek bands, R. P. Laurent. Man, and bands is talking about he think Doug is black ball. And we also interviewed uh, an artist by the name of Disco from eighty eight. Oh, there. bro. He said he's black ball. He didn't explain why, but he said he's black ball. Yeah, I got to do my own work on him. I mean, I, I, by the time this out, it'll be out. That part will be out. But yeah, yeah, he said he was black ball. That was crazy. Like, bro, he said, you, you said you black ball? All right, that's great. Yeah, for sure. Like, I, I, ain't, I, ain't yeah. really, I ain't really heard too much from him, but yeah, like, a lot of them. Yeah, 10K, Kobe, BE, Benz, Chirac, Benz, Young, Dutch. You know? And I just said, Disco, who said he's black ball. Mm -hmm. Well, we got these nice little pens, list, list of people who's black ball. That's just a few. You know? That's just a handful right there. That's just a handful that I can really name.